there are big announcements. Elon Musk's latest reveal on Tesla's humanoid robot, Optimus, is firmly in that second camp. In a simple tweet exchange, Musk has once again given us a glimpse into Tesla's ambitious future. And let's just say, it's a future where robots are no longer just a concept, but a key part of our world. It all started with a tweet from John Carmack, a prominent tech figure, voicing his doubts about the near-term viability of humanoid robots. Carmack wrote, I am more skeptical than a lot of people in the tech space about the near-term utility of humanoid robots. Long-term, driven by AGI, sure, they are going to be an enormous economic engine. But business plans that have them making a dent in the next five years seem unlikely. Essentially, Carmack sees potential in the long game, but doubts humanoid robots are ready to play a major role in the workforce anytime soon. In a classic Musk fashion, he responded with a mix of optimism and subtle challenge. Well, Optimus is already doing some tasks in the factory, and the scope of its ability is increasing rapidly. But Musk didn't stop there. He went on to reveal what he sees as the main hurdle. The toughest part by far is improving the design of Optimus for ease of manufacturing and tooling up a complex supply chain so it can be made in significant numbers. This exchange provides a fascinating glimpse into Musk's thinking and hints at what Tesla's future might hold. So, what exactly is going on with Optimus in Tesla's factories? How is it evolving? And could Musk actually turn this ambitious vision of a robotic workforce into reality? Optimus's role at the Tesla factory. A sneak peek into the future. When Musk mentioned that Optimus is already performing tasks in Tesla's factories, he instantly sparked a wave of curiosity. Is Optimus really taking on duties traditionally done by humans? And if so, what kind of tasks are these? The idea of a humanoid robot operating in one of Tesla's advanced factories suggests a radical shift, not just for Tesla, but for the future of manufacturing itself. Let's paint a picture. Tesla's factories are some of the most advanced in the world, featuring high levels of automation with mechanical arms, sophisticated conveyor belts, and laser precision machinery. Now enter Optimus. Unlike a standard robotic arm, Optimus isn't confined to a single station or task. This humanoid robot can theoretically move between different areas, adapting to various jobs as needed. It could carry parts, assemble small components, or even inspect and monitor quality, tasks that, up until now, required human hands and eyes. While Tesla's traditional robotic systems are efficient, they lack the flexibility and adaptability of humans. This is where Optimus could stand out. Imagine a robot that can switch from one task to another based on demand or detect errors in real time and take corrective actions. In an industry where every second counts, such capabilities could be transformative. Musk versus skeptics. Can Tesla actually break new ground in robotics? John Carmack's skepticism speaks to a broader conversation in the tech world about humanoid robots. The idea is exciting, but it's also challenging on multiple levels, technologically, financially, and even philosophically. Carmack represents a cautious perspective, one that recognizes the potential for robots but questions their feasibility in the immediate future. Humanoid robots have faced numerous hurdles over the years, from battery life and mobility issues to the complexity of real-time decision-making in dynamic environments. There's also the question of cost. Many robotic startups have struggled to create economically viable robots because, while they can produce a few functional models, scaling them up and making them affordable is a different story. Carmack hinted that Tesla might be in a unique position to succeed here, noting that Tesla can play a long game and maybe win, but I don't like the odds for startups. For Tesla, Optimus isn't just a product. It's a potentially revolutionary tool that could redefine industries. But to succeed, they'll need to overcome challenges that have left other robotics projects stalled in the lab or limited to niche applications. The Design Dilemma What it takes to make Optimus viable In his tweet, Musk pointed out that while Optimus is already functional, making it viable on a large scale is another story. The toughest part by far, Musk wrote, 
is improving the design of Optimus for ease of manufacturing and tooling up a complex supply chain. This is a critical point, because mass-producing a robot of this complexity is no small feat. For starters, the design of Optimus has to be efficient enough for high-volume production. Tesla needs to consider factors like durability, energy efficiency, and material sourcing, all while ensuring that each unit performs reliably and meets safety standards. Imagine the vast array of components that go into a humanoid robot. Motors, joints, sensors, cameras, batteries, and a central processing unit, among other things. Every part has to be designed with both performance and cost in mind. Then there's the supply chain. Tesla's supply chain is already stretched thin with electric vehicles which require specialized materials like lithium for batteries and high-grade steel for the body. With Optimus, they'll need to develop new supplier relationships for robotics-specific components. This includes advanced sensors, AI processors, and flexible materials that allow the robot to move in a human-like manner. It's an entirely new frontier, and Tesla will need to create a supply chain robust enough to support not just a few prototypes, but potentially thousands or millions of units. What could a scaled-up Optimus mean for industry and society? If Tesla manages to solve these production challenges, the possibilities for Optimus are vast. Humanoid robots could become a mainstay in industries that rely on repetitive, labor-intensive tasks. Think about warehouses, where picking, sorting, and packaging are key operations. Instead of employing large numbers of human workers, a fleet of Optimus robots could handle these tasks with precision, speed, and, importantly, around-the-clock operation without fatigue. But the vision extends beyond just factories and warehouses. Elon Musk has spoken about Optimus as a general-purpose robot, which implies a much broader range of applications. Imagine Optimus working in sectors that currently lack enough human labor due to high physical demands or safety risks, such as construction or firefighting. Or consider how it could assist in elder care, providing physical support to people who have mobility issues or performing tasks that might otherwise require expensive human assistance. In a broader sense, the rise of humanoid robots like Optimus could have profound implications for society. Automation has always sparked fears of job loss, but robots capable of taking on complex human-like tasks introduce new questions about the future of work and the role of humans in various industries. If Optimus truly becomes a general-purpose robot, it could open up opportunities for human workers to focus on creative, strategic, and emotionally driven roles, leaving the more physically demanding or monotonous tasks to robots. Final Thoughts Tesla's vision for Optimus is bold and potentially world-changing. The exchange between Carmack and Musk is more than just an exchange of opinions. It highlights a fascinating clash of perspectives. On one side, the cautious realism of seasoned tech experts who understand the enormous hurdles facing robotics. On the other, Musk's relentless optimism and willingness to push boundaries, regardless of the risks. While Carmack voices what many in the tech industry believe, that humanoid robots are still a distant reality. Musk seems determined to make that future happen now. For those watching Tesla and Musk, this is just the latest chapter in an unfolding story of innovation and ambition. If Musk can deliver on his promises with Optimus, we could be witnessing the birth of a whole new industry. One where robots aren't just theoretical concepts, but practical tools embedded in everyday life. As we wait to see how Tesla's efforts unfold, one thing is clear. The future Musk envisions is one where technology is constantly pushing the limits of what's possible. Whether or not Optimus reaches the scale Musk hopes for in the next few years, this journey will undoubtedly shape the future of robotics, manufacturing, and perhaps even the way we live and work. One tweet at a time, Musk continues to keep us guessing and dreaming about what tomorrow might hold. Let me know your thought in the comment, and don't forget to subscribe and turn on the bell icon for the latest updates. Thanks for watching, and we'll catch you in the next one.